the coronavirus pandemic has ravaged the lives of hundreds of millions of people across the globe. The economic, social, emotional, and mental effect of the unforeseen pandemic has been beyond our wildest of imagination. In these extraordinary times of distress, some ordinary people amongst us turned out to be the real heroes, one of which is Catalin Carrico. Credited for the development of the COVID-19 vaccine, Dr. Carrico's early research into mRNA eventually led to the development of Moderna and Pfizer-BioNTech vaccines. The stunningly successful vaccines made by Pfizer-BioNTech and Moderna have their foundation in the works of Carrico and her close collaborator, Dr. Drew Wiesman. In this video, let us learn a little more about this not-so-ordinary hero of the not-so-ordinary pandemic. Carrico, a Hungarian scientist, was born and grew up in Kisuizalas, in Hungary, where she attended Moritz Zsigmond Reformatus Gymnasium. Born to a butcher, Katalin decided she wanted to be a scientist, although she had never met one. After earning her PhD at the University of Szeged, Kariko continued her research and worked as a postdoctoral fellow at its biological research center. In 1985, when the university's research program ran out of money, Dr. Kariko, her husband, and two-year-old daughter, Susan, moved to Philadelphia for a job as a postdoctoral student at Temple University. In fact, during that time, the Hungarian government only allowed them to take $100 out of the country, so she and her husband sewed 900 euros into Susan's teddy bear. Oh, and by the way, did we tell you that Susan grew up to become a two-time Olympic gold medalist in rowing? For her entire career, Dr. Carrico has focused on mRNA, which is the genetic script that carries DNA instructions to each cell's protein-making machinery. She was convinced that mRNA could be used to instruct cells to make their own medicines, including vaccines. Dr. Carrico lives for the bench, that is the spot in the lab where she works. She cares little for fame. Her colleagues say that she was, in a positive sense, kind of obsessed with the concept of messenger RNA. In fact, when Dr. Carrico started, it was early days in the mRNA field, so much so that only the basic questions like how do you make RNA molecules in a lab? Or how do you get mRNA into cells of the body? were talked about. Now let's talk about her role in the COVID-19 vaccine development. Researchers had known for 20 years that the crucial feature of any coronavirus is the spike protein sitting on its surface, which allows the virus to inject itself into human cells. The idea behind both BioNTech and Moderna vaccines was to introduce mRNA into the body that would briefly instruct human cells to produce the coronavirus's spike protein. The immune system would see the protein, recognize it as alien, and learn to attack the coronavirus if it ever appeared in the body. On November 8, 2020, the first results of the Pfizer-BioNTech study came in, showing that the mRNA vaccine offered powerful immunity to the new virus. In order to celebrate, she ate an entire box of Goober's chocolate-covered peanuts, while Dr. Wiesman celebrated with his family, having dinner from an Italian restaurant. Dr. Carrico and Dr. Wiesman were vaccinated on December 18 at the University of Pennsylvania. Their inoculations turned into a press event, and as the cameras flashed, she began to feel overwhelmed. Hats off to the powerful lady and her team on such a miraculous achievement. We hope that she continues to serve humanity just like this, with all her zeal. That was all about Catalin Carrico for you. Do like, share, comment and subscribe to our channel, Explified.